Saudi Aramco is now the world's most valuable company. And of course, it just reflects exactly what's been happening in the stock market. Apple was the most valuable company in the world worth a three a trillion. It's now down to 2.3 a trillion. And the reason for that is tech shares have been sold off because people are looking to buy shares in things that are in demand and you can't replace. Saudi Aramco is taking the place. 2.3 for Apple, 2.4 so Saudi Aramco. Why? Energy short supply and you don't go without it. You need energy. We need oil in the world. There is a shortage and Saudi Aramco is expected to give bumper profits which could of course make the share price go even further. Apple on the other hand, you might not renew your iPhone as often as you did previously if times are tougher. So what the market is saying that if a company produces goods that people are less likely to do as often, that company's profits are going to fall. And that's what's here, Apple. Apple, of course, has got a whole series of new pro pro products that are coming out very, very shortly. Will those shares recover? Well, yes, they will recover. So right now, you're going to see energy continue to go. There's no sign at the moment of energy falling off and the actual price of oil will continue to be as it is. So Saudi Aramco can be super profitable. But once we get through the tighter times, the times where we have this supply chain issue, perhaps from China, we have the war in Ukraine with Russia. Once these things start to go away, inflation starts to go away, interest rates are not risen as much as perhaps people expect, then of course, all of a sudden, once you get past that, then the companies that recover the quickest and make the biggest returns will be companies like Apple. So right now, it's Saudi Aramco. It's going to stay with Saudi Aramco for a period of time. At some point, Apple's coming back. Okay, you've got to watch out for that point. The way to watch out for it is make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel, like and share the video, and I'll keep you informed on what's happening in the markets, what's happening with tech, and when it's the right time to be looking at investing. Right now, there's big opportunities. Just got to be in the right sector. And of course, you can make sure you're in the right sector by talking to a good financial advisor, watching YouTube, making sure you're informed of the information that's happening in the world.